morning students and welcome to our youtube channel gnan manjari modern school so in the previous video we have just started the chapter number 3 that was hcf and lcm but in the previous chapter i have some forgotted some of the topics okay students i have forgotted some of the topics so first of all we will do the chapter number 2 some of the topic divisibility by 8 9 10 and 11 just we haven't done that so first of all we will do that and then after we will go forward in the chapter number 3 that is hcf and lcm okay students now see here first of all doing the divisibility test for we have just remaining 8 9 and 10th divisibility test let us do that first of all students see here for 9 divisibility test for 9 what is important see here i am just taking the example of it directly i am taking example number see here first of all i am writing chapter 2 over here so if you just cut the videos then you can know that we are just going to the chapter number 2 divisibility test divisibility test by 9 sorry yes divisibility test by 9 so how we will solve this let us see an example of it that is example number 21 example number 21 let us see that students here 21a that is 3 4 5 and b that is 8 1 5 c that is 3 4 6 5 3 4 6 5 so how we do the divisibility test of 3 we just add all the digits which are in that number so in 9 also we have to add each of the digits okay students see here the total here in the a 3 plus 4 plus 5 plus 7 4 plus 3 7 Seven plus seven, fourteen. Fourteen plus five, fourteen. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, and nineteen. Nineteen is there. If nineteen is coming in the table of nine, no, it is not coming in the table of nine. So this is not divisible by nine. This is not. divisible by 9 okay students moving towards next see here here 8 plus 1 plus 5 plus 4 see here if i say here 4 plus 1 that is 5 5 plus 5 10 10 plus 8 that is 18 is 18 coming in the table of 9 yes 9 to the 18 so this is divisible divisible by 9 see are moving towards next that is 3 Four six five. So three plus four plus six plus five. So first of all, six plus four ten. Five plus three eight. Ten plus eight eighteen. Yes, this is divisible by nine. Okay, students, this is also divisible by nine. 
this is also and this is not please note down the students and then after me we will move further okay students moving towards next that is divisibility test by 10 so divisibility test by divisibility test by 10 see here usually the number is divisible by 10 only and only when the unit place of that number the unit place of that number is 0 okay students is 0 see here 5 is not divisible by 10 but 10 is divisible by 10 20 is divisible by 10 20 to sorry 200 is divisible by 10 2000 is divisible by 10 why because it the last sorry yet the unit place there is zero so it is divisible by 10 let us see an example which is given in your textbook okay students see that is example number 22 example number 22 writing that on the board example number 22 A. That is one three four seven. One three four seven. B. That is seven eight zero. And C. It is eight double zero three. Eight double zero three. So first of all, solving A. That is. what if it is divisible by 10 then its unit place must be 0 see here its unit place is 7 so this is not divisible by 10 okay students this is not divisible by 10 moving further see here at the unit place it is 0 at the unit place it is 0 so this is divisible by 10 moving further See here, its unit place is three, so this is not divisible by ten. Okay, students, I haven't written some of the description that you can write from your textbook. Now going further for the eleven divisibility test by eleven. Let us see that. so here see here a table is given a table is given over here you can see in that the divisibility test by 11 see here first of all the number is given 1 2 1 sum of the digits at 
odd places are from right sum of the digits at even places from right difference and it is divisible or not see here i am just doing that how they are doing see this is 11 and see here first of all they have taken 1 2 1 so first they what do they have taken the digits odd digits odd digits from the right hand side so this is 1 and this is 1 so 1 plus 1 is equal to 2 now even digits from the left uh, sorry right hand side even digits so this is only 2 so 2 now just taking difference of it so from this that is 2 minus 2 that is 0 so this is divisible by 11 okay students going further they have taken the number another number that is 1331 1 31 okay students so first of all what we have to do odd digit even digit okay students odd digit from right hand side 1 2 3 4 this all are odd digits okay students this all are odd digits now what we have to do sorry students odd not odd numbers odd places odd places means 1 3 5 that means that okay students odd places so 1 3 1 plus 3 that is 4 and now even places 3 1 so 3 plus 1 that is also 4 so the difference is 4 minus 4 that is 0 so this is divisible by 11 okay students moving further they if we take an another example 1 4 4 4 1 if we take then what we have to do sum of the odd places and here sum of the even places and then we have to take the difference so sum of the odd places r 1 plus 4 plus 1 and sum of the even places that is 4 plus 4 that is 8 okay students taking difference 4 plus 2 6 so 8 minus 6 that is 2 okay students so this is not divisible by 11 and going towards next example if i take the 1 2 3 4 5 6 1 2 3 4 first of all sum of the even sorry odd odd places sum sum of the odd places so that is odds are 1 3 5 1 3 plus 5 plus that is 9 and then after even 2 plus 4 plus 6 so 2 plus 4 plus 6 that is 12 so the difference is 12 minus 9 that is 3 so this is also not divisible by 11 okay students now some of the numbers are given in the example number 23 let us solve that students
एग्जाम्पल नंबर ट्वेंटी थ्री लेटर सी द स्टूडेंट्स हियर ए इज थ्री फोर सिक्स सेवन बी इज डबल फाइव जीरो सिक्स थ्री सॉरी सिक्स फोर फाइव थ्री सिक्स फोर एंड सी इज एट वन एट नाइन फाइव एट वन एट नाइन फाइव दैट इज सी ओके स्टूडेंट्स नाउ लेट अस सॉल्व वन बाय वन जो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल सम ऑफ ऑड प्लेसेस दैट इज फोर प्लस सिक्स सॉरी थ्री प्लस सिक्स थ्री प्लस सिक्स दैट इज नाइन एंड देन आफ्टर इवन प्लेसेस दैट इज फोर प्लस सेवन सेवन प्लस फोर इलेवन सो डिफरेंस दैट इज इलेवन माइनस नाइन then what is the difference that is 2 so this is not divisible by 11 moving further see your students moving further here sum of first of all odd digits 5 plus 0 plus 4 5 plus 4 9 then after even digits even places sorry not digits Even places and odd places. So three plus six, that is nine. So difference is nine minus nine, zero. So this is divisible by eleven. And the last one that is eighty one, eighty nine five. So first of all, odd places. That is eight plus eight plus five. Eight. Two is a sixteen plus five twenty one, and even that is one plus nine that is ten. So if I minus twenty one minus ten, that is eleven. So this digit is divisible by eleven or not? Can you, anybody tell me, students? Yes, we have got difference eleven. Then it is divisible by eleven. Yes, it is divisible by eleven. The difference must be the multiple of eleven. Okay, students, difference must be the multiple of eleven. Okay, students, now going towards the exercise. And in exercise, you have to do. Question one, two, and three by yourself only because it is easy. And moving towards next, I will solve one one sum of eight, so you can solve it. ओके स्टूडेंट्स नाउ गोइंग टूवर्ड्स क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर यू आर गिवन थ्री डिजिट्स दैट इज सेवन टू एंड नाइन सी यर एक्सरसाइज टू जी क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर So here you are given seven, two, and nine. Okay, students, seven, two, and nine. Now let us see a how many three-digit numbers can be formed without repeating any of them. We have to first of all find how many digits can be formed from these three. digits so first of all the digit is 7 2 9 first digit must be 7 2 9 
देन आफ्टर सेवन नाइन टू सेवन नाइन टू ओके स्टूडेंट्स दिस टू आर फॉर्म नाउ नेक्स्ट नाउ वी विल टेक इन फ्रंट टू दैट इज टू सेवन नाइन देन आफ्टर टू नाइन सेवन एंड देन आफ्टर going further in that we will take in front 9 9 7 2 okay students this six numbers can be possible by this three digits okay students six numbers can be formed you have to write without any of them repeating b how many see here i am writing six digits sorry Six can be formed six can be formed that is a and moving towards b how many of the number formed in a are divisible by three and why so you have to find out how many of this digit are divisible by Three, okay, students. Which numbers are divisible by three? So divisible by three. What we have to do? We have to just add this number. Seven plus two, nine. Nine plus nine, eighteen. Yes, it is divisible by three. So this number is divisible by three. Seven plus nine plus two, eighteen. So this is number is also divisible by three, and. Two plus seven, two plus seven plus nine. That is eighteen. This is this number is also divisible by three. This number is also divisible by three. This number is also divisible by three, and this number is also divisible by three. Why? Because the sum of the total in all these numbers is eighteen. So these all digits are divisible by three. Okay, students. Our next question C. How many of the numbers formed in A are divisible by nine? So, which of these numbers are divisible by nine? First of all, I'm writing divisible. Divisible by three and divisible by nine. All have the sum eighteen. In nine also, we have to find the total seven plus two nine. Nine plus nine, eighteen. So all the numbers in this are divisible by nine also. That is seven two nine seven nine two two seven nine two nine seven nine seven two nine two seven divisible by nine. Okay, students, divisible by nine. Now. we all know that now sorry in the d in the d we have to find that it is divisible by 6 or not so for that what we have to do we have to just find that it is the numbers which are divisible by 2 and 3 then that number is divisible by 6 so this all numbers are divisible by 3 we have to find in From this, which which number are divisible by two? That is divisible by six. Okay, students. So for the divisibility for two, at the last it must be even number. So here it is not even number. Yes, here it is even number. So seven nine two. Here is odd. Here is odd. Here is even. So nine seven two. Here is odd or sorry. Here is also odd. So this numbers are divisible by 6 by 6 these numbers are divisible by 6 please note down the answer students
ओके स्टूडेंट्स नाउ गोइंग टूवर्ड्स क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव सी यर एक्सरसाइज टू जी क्वेश्चन फाइव दैट इज सेवन टू ए सेवन टू ए थ्री एट फोर थ्री एट फोर इज ए नंबर इन विच वन डिजिट ऑफ वन ऑफ द डिजिट इज ए इफ द नंबर इज एग्जैक्टली डिविजिबल बाय नाइन what is the number value of a so we have to find the value of a over here okay students we have to find the value of a but how we will find they have said that this number is divisible by 9 this number should be divisible by by 9 okay students so first of all if the number is divisible by 9 then we have to do the total so 7 plus 2 plus a plus 3 plus 8 plus 4 so 7 plus 2 9 9 9, 9 3 9 10 11 12 12 12 plus 8 20, 20 4, 24 20 4 plus a, 24 plus a. Okay, students. If I take an equation is equal to zero, is equal to zero, then no, students. It can't be is equal to zero. It should be divisibility of Nine. So, if I add in twenty-four, what should I add? So it is the divisible of nine. So twenty-seven is divisible of nine. Okay, students. So in twenty-four, how much I have to add? So it can be divisible of nine. So Twenty-four plus three is equal to twenty-seven. So a should be three. A should be three. So this number is divisible by nine. Okay, students. A is equal to three. Why? Because this number should be divisible by nine. So if we add in twenty-four three, then it is divisible by nine. Okay, students. Please note down this. Again, students, I am re repeating that I am just running the chapter number two, playing with numbers. Okay, students. Why? Because I have forgot to just take some of the last topics of it, and I have just started the chapter number three, that is HCF and LCM. So first of all, we will complete this, and we will then we will continue in our chapter number three. Okay, students. Now please write down your today's homework. So your today's homework is. Example. Twenty one, twenty two, and twenty three. Okay, students. Twenty one, twenty two, and twenty three. And full exercise two G. Okay, students. And in the next video, first of all, I will solve the uh, ex uh, exercise two G question six. 
एंड सेवन एंड देन आफ्टर वी विल गो टू दी लेसन नंबर थ्री दैट इज एच सी एफ एंड एल सी एम ओके स्टूडेंट्स अपटिल देन स्टे सेफ स्टे होम ओके बाय स्टूडेंट्स